What's up everybody, this is Zoya the Russian Korean and Riot has now pre-released the debonair skins. I believe it was like two days ago. This is one of the skin lines that we all voted on like at the beginning of the year or during the preseason. I actually forget exactly when the vote was but Crime City Nightmare like won but they also had one that was kind of like Pokemon themed a little bit like with the little creatures next to the champions and then another one was the debonair. I personally voted for the debonair so they still are releasing skins uh, with this theme so i'm pretty pleased with that and there are seven of them and here are the champions that are getting the debonair skins those are brand mastery zed leona leblanc draven and Malzahar. i'm interested to see uh what kind of what kind of theme this is and how is it like much different from crime city nightmare i believe they're all epic except for the zed skin which is legendary so we will take a look at the Zed skin last since it is legendary but we'll start out with uh, some of the epic ones. Before we begin though I have checked out many of the other different skin lines uh, before so if you're interested in seeing that you can check out the playlist I will leave a card somewhere up here and as always if you enjoy this kind of content please do consider liking this video, sharing it with your friends, subscribing to the channel if you haven't already done so and commenting your thoughts on the skins in the comment section down below. And with that being said let's get into the debonair skins. And we are starting out with Debonair Mastery, Skin Spotlight pre-release. Let's take a look. Okay, this is the recall. His hair, though. <laughs> okay. Not a bad recall. Alright, the splash arc, my favorite part. Uh-huh. Okay, so I'm kind of seeing the theme here a little bit. There are these metallic gray black colors and this neon green. They made another e-boy. <laughs> but the orange glasses are a nice touch. The splasher is probably my favorite part. Defend yourself. I don't know, the voice is like too old for the way that he looks, at least in the splash. Ooh, the W is nice. Alright, we have our E here. And the ultimate. Ooh. The ultimate actually looks pretty cool. I like the ultimate, kind of the mist behind him. And when he cues, there's a little, little sign, or I'm not, I'm not sure exactly if that's like a banner. I think it's more of a sign. Crit. And death. And Chromas, guys, can I just say that this one right here and this one and this one, these three, to me, for some reason, look like Sentinel Vane just with a sword. <laughs> you know what I mean? There's something about the face. I guess it's the glasses and maybe like the highlight on the hair, the short hair that uh, if you like ignore the ponytail that looks like sentinel vein that being said nice colors on the chromas i do like this one yeah okay so that was debonair master yi skin spotlight uh not bad actually i like the way the ultimate looked i'm sorry about the little jingle in the background that's actually kaisa playing and like i can't I just can't stop her. I closed the door and you can still hear it. But anyways, let's move on to another skin and uh, let's take a look at Malzahar. How about that? Malzahar was actually the one that we kind of saw a concept of in uh, uh, during the vote. Let's see how they shaped him into the debonair skin. He's also young. And he has a shirt, but it's not very functional, is it? <laughs> okay, so it's a double splash right here. Look at that. 
So we're actually seeing them from like this lower angle. I believe this is LeBlanc. And right here is Malzahar. Look at that. Uh, for those of you Malzahar mains out there, I'm sure if you are, if, if you if you want to be silly, you probably would go with the B, the B Malzahar one. But if you want to look sleek and uh, handsome, I guess you can pick this one. Once again, the same color scheme right here. It's a little bit close to in theme in terms of like colors to Crime City Nightmare in that there are like two major colors. In Crime City Nightmare, it was like purple and black, right? And a little bit of red. And here we're seeing uh, gray and green and variations of, of those colors. Interesting. And he has this bluish, like powder bluish hair. Again, the voice doesn't suit his look at all. <laughs> It's like when he doesn't open his mouth, you just look at him, it's like, ooh, but then he opens his mouth and you're like, ooh. <laughs> the little bugs, okay. Yeah, the metallic is very prominent in this skin. I believe this is E, right? I don't play Malzahar. So... And the infamous alt. Yeah, the debonair little flowery, kind of clovery looking sign. Pattern. Okay. So I think with these skins, we're not gonna see too much variation in terms of like color and effects. And honestly, with Malzahar, his model is not the focus of the skin, right? It's the bugs and the poison and and all the... That was a surprising death. <laughs> but anyway, what I was trying to say, he himself is not like the focus. The focus is like what he does and the effects around that. But uh, here are the chromas. Look at that. Some of these look nice. He looks very tan in some of these. And then the bugs, the bug chromas. Those are nice too. I actually do like the chromas for these types of skins where, or skin lines, where the base colors for the champions that are part of the skin line are all the same. Like you might as well get a chroma just to stand out a little bit, unless you're all going for that. Let's say you're like a five man pre-made and then you all want to have the this debonair theme or something. But anyway, that was Malzahar. Uh, do I like Malzahar or Master Yi more? I mean, Malzahar does have more effects, but I did like the look of, the Master Yi skin as well. So for me, they're kind of tied, honestly. Let's take a look at Debonair Draven now. Okay, the recall. <laughs> cool recall. Definitely has that Draven swag. Look at that. He's like, he's like the bartender or something. Kind of looks like he is, or maybe he just has this bottle. I like the green glasses. <laughs> oh, the coins. Ooh. Look at that, it's like a cobra. That's pretty cool. Now, once again, because this is like a heavy auto attack based champion, we're not gonna be seeing like these fancy patterns and splashes of color. Although I do like the, the Cobra. Okay. The ultimate. Yeah, like I said, I mean, predictably so, because of the color, the restrictive color, color, how do I say, the, the color theme and the color scheme of this skin. 
There's only so much you will see in terms of effects. But I do like their creative way of like making each champion stand out a little, like this guy. Instead of just having that, you know, the regular debonair pattern that we saw in Mastery and Malzahar, this guy actually has the Cobra. And death. Oh, but the chromas look nice. I like all of them. This orange one is nice too, right in the middle. It actually looks more reddish than orange. But that was Debonair Draven. Okay, uh, where would I put it? I would probably put it a little bit above Master E, but maybe a little bit below Malzahar. Just because, like I said, Malzahar, like the, the idea there is the effects, right? It's not really the, ch the champion model. Whereas with Master E and with Draven, it is the champion model. So, but anyway, uh, I like the Cobra here. Uh, let's move on to Debonair Leona. All right, recall. <laughs> I like the bullets. <laughs> Very suave. Let's take a look at the splash. Oh, no splash yet. Nah. Splash is my favorite part. Look at her, um, the, the tail on her cape or coat. It's like a little bit transparent for some reason. All right, W and E. Ever vigilant. Oh, E looks. Hold on a second. Ultimate. They, 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 they just only showed E like one time. This one also has a snake on it. Twilight fades. Crit and death. There's not too much with Leona. Interesting. It's only a minute and 26 seconds. I guess because this skin, they haven't like fully worked out yet or something. There is even no splash for it, so. But those were the chromas also. Okay, so that was Debonair Leona. Hmm. We'll have to wait for the, not the pre-release, but the actual released uh, skin so that uh, we can make a better judgment. But so far, actually, out of all the recalls, I liked her recall the best. But now let's check out the Debonair LeBlanc skin spotlight pre-release. Again, the couch. Isn't it nice? You can just talk to yourself. <laughs> we have seen the splash, but let's take a look at it again. I like how her orange hair just like contrasts everything. She does look a little bit like, uh, you know, the, what is it? The, the ruined misfortune. I forget, I forget. I think it was ruined skins, right? Because it has the same color scheme. Except Miss Fortune doesn't have, in her skin, she doesn't have orange hair, she has white hair. But if she did have orange hair, they'd probably look almost the same. Very similar. The passive. Time to make an appearance. Okay, the the thing looks a little bit like a... <laughs> you know what that looks like? That little sign? <laughs> it looks like a raccoon. <laughs> I know it's not supposed to be. It's like a lotus or something. Ooh, I do like the, the stamp on the ground. When she W's. Ooh, look at that. When she snares you, right? There's this little... Thing that rotates around you. Yeah, I like that. I like that detail. It's interesting that uh, they chose this purple here. I think with LeBlanc, they had a little more leniency in terms of colors. They added this purple color, which I think is nice. It's not all just green, green, green. And death. 
Ooh, wow. Look at the chromas. I like the yellow one. This one is nice. This one is nice. This one is... Actually, all of them look pretty nice. But this one looks like the... What's it called? The Elderwood or whatever. <clears throat> LeBlanc. In terms of colors. But Debonair LeBlanc. Uh, what do I think? I think I would actually put it about the same as Mazahar, probably. Maybe a little bit above it, just because there is a little more variation in terms of colors with her. It's interesting also because they are on the same splash. <laughs> okay, but let's move on. We have one more epic skin from the skin line, and that is Debonair Brand. Oh my goodness, what is his face? That looks like Shaco. He has like this mask. I wonder what the splash looks like. Ah, okay. Uh, in the splash, his mask looks a little bit different. <laughs> you know what I mean? It has a different vibe. In the uh, in the recall, at least when I was looking, it looked like a clown mask. But here, it definitely doesn't look like a clown mask at all. Now I'm assuming all the colors are going to be just green flames, right? It has to be. Oh, there is the metallic gray. I do like it, yeah. But yeah, otherwise it's... It's like the... The zombie... The zombie brand, where everything's green. But the metallic... Bluish... Gray... Does make it look fancier. And more sleek. So that was the alt, by the way. Okay. Crit! And death. Honestly, the brand one is a bit underwhelming. Maybe it's just me, but... I mean, of all of these champions that are in the skin line, Brand is probably the one that I would play the most. I, I don't play Malzahar, I don't really play LeBlanc, I don't play Mastery. Uh, who else did we look at? Uh, maybe Leona a little bit, but not much. Like, Brand a lot more often, but like, I wouldn't... Honestly, I wouldn't, I wouldn't get the skin. <laughs> I feel like the splash looks okay, but like, if I get it from a reroll or something, then yeah. But otherwise, even the, even the chromas are like, okay. I don't know. Something about something about it is just a little bit underwhelming for me. But uh, that was Debonair Brand. What do you guys think about that? Let me know in the comments. But that leaves us now with Zed. And Zed is a legendary. There are voice lines for it. We're not going to take a look at the voice lines today, but we're just going to take a look at the actual skin. All right. And Debonair Zed skin spotlight pre-release already looking different from all the other ones. Why? The colors, of course, right? I mean, we do have the purple showing here, as well as the green that actually more looks like this neon yellow. Uh, let, let's see. Let's see what the skin looks like. Recall? Oh, shit. Nice red carpet appearance, but uh, when he was recalling, that almost looked like Crime City Nightmare. Didn't it? Look at that. Oh, look at the shadows. That's pretty. That's that's a pretty cool splash. I like it. The green tie, my goodness. <laughs> uh, okay. And the snaky patterns right here. Alright. Joke one. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> he can't drink. You have no idea how dead you are about to be. Control two. Okay. Looks scary. <laughs> I like the dance. <laughs> So far, so good. I like it. 
The dance was- uh, the, the jokes and the dance were pretty funny. I like that they went with something funny. I'm not sure how I feel about the sleeves. You see these sleeves that just like flail? Like what's up with that? Or a shadow? The shadow looks cool. The shoot again. It looks a lot darker than, uh, you know, the LeBlanc clone. The E looks really smooth. And the ult. Let's take a look at the ult again. Whoa. There's a lot going on with the ult. There are the Crime City Nightmare-ish eyes. Yeah, there's the metallic shuriken and then the little pattern here. There's a lot going on. Then the three, the, 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 whatever you call that. I forget what you call that. It looks like the Irish thing, but upside down. And death. Okay. <laughs> Respawn. And home guard. Home guard, not bad. <laughs> Actually, out of um, all of these uh, chromas, I think I like I like this one. I like the red and black one the most. Okay, Debonair Zed, huh? This is a legendary. It does have a legendary flair to it. I did like all of the jokes. I think I think I think those were pretty good. Uh, the dance, the dance was funny. Uh, the colors, of course, like especially during the ultimate, I feel like there was a lot going on. They put in a lot of details. So I'm sure if I keep looking at the at the different effects, I would probably spot like even more special effects here and there. Hi, Sa. I don't know why she's so loud today. But anyways, guys, those were the debonair skins. How did you like them? Are you planning on getting any of them? Which one was your favorite? Which of these do you think was the most underwhelming? Let me know in the comment section below. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. This was Zoya, the Russian Korean. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time.